Well, a very good morning to you. Rich here in the auditorium, coming to you just to give you some clarity with regards to the past week that we have gone through. So uh, I know that perhaps a number of you are wondering what on earth is going on. Well, we were too until kind of late yesterday afternoon after the provincial announcement because uh, communities of faith weren't mentioned at all. Our fellowship, uh, the family and association of churches that we belong to, uh, did some uh, digging around, contacted the premier's office, and we have been granted the small mercy of uh, continuing to have 15% capacity for our worship services. Now, having said that, um, we will enact really a plan that, the, that we had a meeting of the minds on Monday night just gone by, a cross-section of the different ministries that were involved uh, here for, for a Sunday, to really figure out a way forward. What would we do? Would we worship inside? Would we worship outside? Would it be multiple services? Wouldn't it be? What, what, what would we do? And so we came up with a plan. We've run it by the board. The board are fine with this. So we're going to try it for the remainder of this lockdown period, this stay-at-home order period. And so what we're going to do is we're going to offer multiple services on a Sunday. Instead of two services, we will have three. And they're going to happen quite rapid fire back to back to back. So what we will do is we will have a 9 o'clock service until 10. Then we will have a 10.15 service until 11.15. Then we will have an 11.30 service till 12.30. So we will keep the auditorium, we will keep the fellowship hall open to really avoid the mixing of congregations. We're going to ask you to come in through the front door proper, but as you come in, uh, you're going to exit, you're going to leave via the double doors to my left, to your right, and you will exit through the back door of the building, okay? So if you're going to chat, we're going to ask, could you please do it outside, okay? We will continue to have hand sanitizer in various places so that you can continue to observe those different uh, requirements, requests that our health unit and that our province and that our government federally wants us to observe, which is the physical distancing of two meters, wearing of masks indoors, and again, sanitizing of hands. Now, in these three services, let me explain what's going to happen. There will be live preaching in all three services, okay? Live preaching in all three services. For the music... There will be live music in the first two services, and what we're going to do is we're going to run a recording in the third service of the music from the first service. You got that? Clear as mud. So in the third service, there's going to be recorded music. It will be up on the screen. It will be a recording of what the, our musicians have done in the very first service, and so that will be what's going on there. But there will still be a live welcome, there will be uh, uh, prayers that you will be able to enter into, and there will be live preaching, okay? So that's the way that we're going to do it. We're going to do it for a number of weeks. We're going to see how this goes. Again, we're kind of leading off the map. We're going to give this our, our the college try. We're going to give it the college try and see how this goes. Now, as weeks go on, we are going to investigate other avenues of getting together. And again, it depends really what the province is kind of telling us to do. So there is a possibility that in the months to come, we may be meeting outside, okay? Please continue to pray for us as we think about these things, as we kind of adapt and adjust to all of the different things that our local health unit and our province uh, wants us to do. But as I said, from this Sunday, we're going to go to a three-service format, 9 to 10, 10.15 to 11.15. There's a 15-minute window of turnaround in between these services. So we're going to have to ask you kindly and politely, 
If you could leave your visiting to outside in the parking lot, that would be great. So 9 to 10, 10, 15 to 11, 15, and then 11, 30 to 12, 30. And again, I ask that you would continue to sign up online. Uh, you can call the office and Melissa will be happy to plug your name in if you're not uh, that computer savvy. Um, and we can help you out that way. We live in interesting days. And uh, again, we really appreciate your prayers. We're going to take this step forward. And we're going to see what the Lord has for us in this. God bless you. I hope that that has cleared up a few of the questions that you perhaps have had. And uh, we look forward to seeing you this coming Sunday. God bless you. Rich signing off for now.